should be fine. Right, eh? Okay, we'll try this one. A little bit more subdued. Yep. Here we go. Hey, hey. Oh, no, no, that wasn't a here we go, here we go. Oh. No, that wasn't a cue. Oh. Not yet. Here we go. That's a cue. Call hey. me <laughs> and Heather from the Layman Preachers. Yes, it is. And we are touching base, just giving you a little roundup on what's been happening in the Preacher Lab. Stacks which, of stuff. Stacks of stuff. That's what we, we made call. a mess. We made a big mess. Um, that's usually my doing. Uh, <laughs> I wasn't going to say Lots has been going on. We released Rich Enough we on did. the 14th of... 17th of January. And it's doing really well. We're My goodness. Stoked. It's lit up. So if you're strong enough and rich enough We've got ourselves on three uh, Spotify curated playlists, which for that's us is a... exciting. Yeah, that's getting it on the first rung of the ladder there, which is awesome. <laughs> and speaking of Rich Enough, just a call out to Mia McKinnon, who played the Boron. 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 Which is your Irish drum. You don't, did a fantastic job. Don't ever pronounce that wrongly to an Irish musician. They, oh, you, you're just, you get crucified. Boron. Boron. Anyway, I think I got that right. The Boron. <laughs> Baron, 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 Baron. other stuff going on as well though haven't we got we do next release yeah. walk on the wild side comes yes. out 31st yeah. of january i've been looking forward to this this is um this is quite a, a theatrical take we we've, we've had on that song there we we yeah. love the song yeah. um I, I can't even remember how it started but we started with this deep and dark mood and um it grew from there grew from there yeah, really we're, happy with the lemon take on it. Though. Yeah, both of us really stoked with, with the vocals that, that work so well on that. Highly Took The Last Train is the release that comes out after Walk On The Wild Side around mid-February, yeah. maybe in time for Valentine's Day. Yep, yep. And we've recently put out a little snippet of mm. um, promo for that featuring a good friend of yours. That's right, Jason on the trumpet. Blowing a bit of brass. I know. So Jason joined us on Old School and really did some tasty work on that. And this time I thought I'd film him while we were recording one of those pieces finger in the ear, but honestly, he nails it every time. Every so thanks around, Jason. Time flies when you're no longer on your own. And these nights have been the best you've ever known. This universe... And speaking of old school, mm. um, I heard a rumour mm. that you posted um, the chords for our songs up on... Ult website, ultimateguitar.com for all you guitar Absolutely. players. Absolutely, and that old school has had the chords downloaded how many times? 27 times. 27 times. How exciting is that? I'm stoked. 27 it's just like, people want to learn your I song. can't believe that. 
<laughs> so it's a good feeling. That was a really good feeling. Absolutely. Um, Lots of exciting stuff happening. No wonder we made a mess. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, we couldn't be happier. I said to Heather I was a little bit scared for a while there when the Instagram reels were starting to take off um, and people were saying, hey, mate, you're up to 5,000 here and 6,000. and Almost and now we're up to 8,000 on one and 3,000 on another. Um, and I think the one of us sitting on the steps is the big one, uh, just just pulling it out and just doing it acoustically. It was a lot of fun that day. And it was. What can I say? What could be more Aussie than uh, sitting on the steps of an old Queenslander on the way to your Having laundry? Having a jam, yeah, yeah. Cool. Yeah. Okay, that's the update from us. Yeah, we still got more moment. songs coming, kids. Keep yep. your ears to the ground. Finger on the poles. Yep. Get your eyeballs on the Lamb and Preacher side. That's it. Good stuff coming. Talk soon. Bye.